solve the particular case of this equation. So we write it in a symbolic form. F of d is equal to d squared plus d plus 1. Now this has two parts. The part whereby this is equal to exponential x. The second part f of d which is equal to d squared plus d plus 1 which is equal to x sine of x. So I start with the first case. You can call this number 1. This other one number 2. I'm going to combine them. So f of d so to get y particular, we are going to have exponential x over d squared plus d plus 1, which is equal to exponential x over 1 squared plus 1 plus 1, which is equal to exponential x divided by minus 1 plus 1 plus 1, which is equal to exponential x over 1. So y particular number 1 is given by exponential x. The other part, we have our rx as equal to x sine of x. So our y particular in that case is given by xv over f of d plus x plus, sorry, f of d prime divided by f of d squared then sine of x. Here our f of d is equal to d squared plus d plus 1. Our f prime meaning that you differentiate d twice will give you 2d 2d plus 1. Then we substitute in the formula our ip is equal to x sine of x divided by d squared d squared plus d plus 1 minus sine of x multiplied by 2d plus 1 we are substituting divided by d squared plus d plus 1 we square then we substitute when by now we shall get x sine of x divided by 1 squared plus d plus 1 minus sine of x into bracket 2d plus 1 divided by bracket 1 squared plus d plus 1. So when we simplify this, we shall get uh, the following. x sine of x over, this is minus 1 plus 1, which you will reduce, so you have d minus this one means you differentiate, so you have minus 2 cos of x minus sine of x divided by. Uh, here you there is a square here, I have omitted because of this. d squared. So, our yp is equal to minus x cos of x. Now, d means, or d means we integrate. So, when we integrate sine of x with respect to, to x, we are going to get minus cos of x. Then, minus 2 cos of x minus sine of x divided by minus 1. So, our yp is equal to minus x cos of x uh, plus 2 cos of x plus sine of x. So our given OD, our given OD was uh, d squared plus d plus one. Uh, remember that here plus exponential x. So our, our given y, which is equal to exponential x plus x sine of x. So it is given by y is equal to y complementary plus y particular which is equal to exponential negative x over 2 into bracket c1 sine of root 3 over x, I mean root 3 over 2 of x plus c2 cos of 
root 3 over 2 of x. Then uh, plus this other part here. Plus exponential x minus x cos of x plus 2 cos of x plus sin of x. So, th so that is our solution of the given OD. And thanks so much for taking your time to start with me. For more such learning, head to tune on to my YouTube channel so that we may continue learning together. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.